Dear friends, the Irish province of the Institute of Christ the King presents Lenten thoughts from the Gospel of the day. Please consider helping us to restore the Church of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Ember Friday A great multitude of sick, of blind, of lame, of withered, waiting for the moving of the water. Picture the pool of Bethsaida, a small pond just within the gates of Jerusalem, and see the multitude of sick persons lying in its porches. See our blessed Lord passing by and attracted by the sight of one severely afflicted, and make vivid to yourself the whole scene related in the Gospel. The blind represent those who have not the light of sacred knowledge, the lame those who have not moral strength to carry out what they see and know to be right, the withered those who have not the unction of divine love. Have I taken pains to acquire the knowledge of my religion, or am I hardly interested? Remember the words of our Lord last Sunday, Not on bread alone doth man live, but in every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. God often inspires us in many ways to discover His will for us. Am I disposed to listen? Do I take quiet time to speak to God? Or can I not stand being in silence? If I consulted a priest when I have been in uncertainty about God's will in my life, do I obey promptly? This consideration is of highest importance in the choice of a state of life, that is our vocation. Does God call us to serve Him in the priesthood, or in religion, or does He will that we should save our souls by marrying and settling in the world? Am I ready to do God's will? Do I trust that He will take care of all my earthly concerns and worries? Whatever I do, I must have the unction of divine love, lest my soul wither and dry up. I must observe the commandments with care, by prayer and the sacraments of penance and the Holy Eucharist. Particular devotions also will help me to progress in divine love, such as praying for the dead and devoutly performing spiritual and corporal works of mercy. One must grow in love of God. O oh, my dear Lord Jesus, how often hast Thou said to me interiorly, Would Thou be made whole? And have I not neglected your most gracious mercy? Have I not preferred to remain spiritually blind and lame and withered? I see my misery and I will no longer refuse thy aid. Help me, dear Jesus, help me, that I may know thy will for me, that I may accomplish it perfectly. Jesus, aid me by thy grace. Interested in almsgiving this Lent, why not help to restore our church in Belfast, the Church of the Immaculate Heart of Mary? Help us make this former Presbyterian Church worthy of the Catholic liturgy. You can donate at this GoFundMe link. May God bless you for your generosity. Like and subscribe for daily Lenten reflections. May the Immaculate Heart of Mary triumph in Ireland.